I thought that I was driving the car. No, 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 no. Get, 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 get in the. No. Okay, so we're on shotgun then. No, no. Get in the, get in the back. Okay. I don't want to sit in the back. Trust me, you're gonna like being in the back. Notice anything different? Oh, well, here's why. Uh, check this out. There's been an update. Look at that. What is that? Uh, that's the rear seats. You can heat the rear seats? Yeah, I'm turning on heat right now. We couldn't heat the rear seats yesterday. Yeah, there was an update last night. That's awesome. Now there's rear seat heating in the Model 3. And get this, there's three levels, just like in the front. Two, one, zero. Wow, I can feel it's going all the way up my back. Yeah, it's just like the front seats. That's really nice. I did notice that the middle seat, because it's not really a full seat, it doesn't have uh, back heating. Oh, okay, but the, the butt heats. But right. The, yeah, that makes sense, because it is the couple. There's no, no heating back here. <laughs> That's sweet. And there's been some other updates too. Come on in the front seat, I'll show you. Oh, yeah. So to get to that heating the seat menu, you just hit the fan icon and then you get your normal climate, but then if you hit the seat tab, you get all control of all the seats in the car. Sweet. And I've already checked, I've hit everywhere on here. I thought maybe there might be a heated steering wheel, but it doesn't appear to be one. Too bad. Yet. All right, so then there's been some other updates. If you go to locks, yep. you now have control of the keys, so you can control whose phone controls what. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, so you can, if you hit that, you can decide to remove that person from being able to drive the car. Interesting. Also, there's been a change to the speed increase on automatic emergency braking. So now, instead of it um, only working up to 50 miles an hour, it now works up to 90 miles an hour. Wow, cool. And they've rearranged the touchscreen icons on the front. So remember that this music icon used to be over there? Oh, right. Now they've moved that and the phone icon over here because they're more they're more popular for the drivers and they've moved the rear and front windshield uh, defrosting over to the right. Interesting. And now you can access the owner's manual from the touch screen. So let's show you that. So down here under service, there's your owner's manual. Oh, and um, so now you can do tire pressure units. You can change it between bar and PSI. Cool. And if you want to contact roadside assistance, you just hit the Tesla T at the top and if, as long as your phone is connected with Bluetooth, the phone number will pop up and you can just hit it to call. So if my phone was cool. connected right now, I could just hit that and I would call. Thanks so much for watching everybody. We wanted to keep you up to date with the latest improvements that are happening to the Model 3 as they get released on software updates. So this is pretty cool. A lot of cool new features just happened overnight. Yep. All right, thanks so much for watching. Now you know.